What's up guys, in today's Gorilla Tag uh, YouTube video, it is going to be a tutorial on, like, I'm going to be explaining my best way of trying to, like, go around the whole map just using walls. Nice impression, bro. I forgot. Is this a nine-year-old? Okay. Just using the walls. So, like, wall run the whole entire map. Um... I am going to take off Rock Monkey for this video. You don't have to. If you're learning, you might want to take it off. Well, actually, it, it, it a wall run right, cur like, well. So if you don't know how to, like, oh, I just messed up completely. If you don't know how to wall run well, then you might, then you might want to try to learn that or use Rock Monkey because it's easier, but... It, whenever you do it in a normal game, then it will be more difficult. Okay, um, so starting right into it. There are multiple places where you can start from. You can start from any way over here. Um, but the place that I kind of like to start is either come over here. And then start going around. Or jump right here and then start going around or just straight up just jump right here and then go around just know I am not the best at going around the map I will try to go around the map real quick so then y'all can see like just a quick example of it I'm messing up so badly but I'm, I'm still not failing And you just want to take it slow when you're doing, but I'm just giving you an example. Okay. This is the hardest part. Uh, most people call it the wall of death. Um, there are two methods to do this, and I will teach you that later. But this is, again, just an example. I messed up but um so just say that I didn't mess up even though I do mess up a lot so I'm up here and then there are two ways I I, I, I am NOT good at this okay so say I make it um and then I throw myself again Okay, so now I'm over here. Mm. Okay, I'm over here. I'm almost around. I still have a kind of long way to go. Well, not actually. I, I'm already around most of the map. So then I'm over here. If I if I need to take a break, then I just jump up a little bit and just like sit on here or something. But it it can mess you up sometimes. You see, and now I'm over basically almost there. So now. I have almost, not yet, but almost, and saying that I didn't mess up over there by the wall of death, I have now made it. Okay, so now I'm going to be teaching you how to actually do it. Okay, so for the most part, um, so like, you see how like, basically everywhere on the wall, See, like, how it's, like, curving this way? Like, going that way? So the wall is going up, and then it's going that way? 
Well, basically on a lot of the walls, whenever you're up high, see, you can see it just like slanting that way, kind of. Basically, you want to be, what I'm trying to say is you want to be basically almost at all times, you want to be up almost all the way on the walls that you can go. You just do, do not want to hit the slippery wall. Okay, um, so you're here. And then you want to come down to where you can see this. And then you want to go up. And then you want to just so like this corner. Well, no, this corner isn't a good spot to do it to show y'all. But you can go down there and it will help if you don't know how to wall climb well. So like mainly... So, you see, like, these corners, so this one right here is a good example. So, you see how it's like a little edge, or a little ledge that you have to go over? You want to, like, stretch your arms around, and then pull yourself. And then, you don't have to go all the way up here, you can go down, but, um, it's just kind of easier for me. Now, this is basically the hardest part. There are two ways that you can do it. One, I don't remember who it is, but I think maybe TTT Pig. I do not remember, though. Um, which is, you can use slippery walls. But if you're not good at slippery walls, then I wouldn't suggest it. Um, so you want to, like, hug it like a box, kind of. And then you want to throw yourself up. Not exactly, but, like, so basically you're climbing, you're pinched climbing, then you want to throw yourself up onto this ledge thing, and then you want to try to, so like, you come up here, you throw yourself up on the ledge, but I cannot do it very well, but I'll try to show you from the... From <laughs> so you wanna from that ledge right there then you can just try to wall run across that just until like you get like right there and then you wanna jump off and then go along there or another way which is more for beginners I believe it is still difficult, but it's more for beginners. Okay, so you want to come here. And then it's called the box throw. Well, box throw. Or something like that. So basically, you want to imagine this thing as like a box. And then you just yeet the box to your right. So you just want to come up here. And then yeet the box to your right. And then you want to go back again, pinch climbing. So once you yeet yourself from the, from the box over there, then you want to climb over here. What, I'm messing up so bad. But you can understand, right? Um, so come over here. You don't have to put your hand on the wall. It's just It just helps me kind of. Um, yeah, it just helps me, kind of. And then you want to come over here, so then once you're right here, you want to do the same thing, but just, uh, like, over here, kind of, yeah. And then, you this wall, it is kind of tricky, but once you get it, it's simple. Most people go across this wall whenever they're low down, and that's a bad thing that you shouldn't do. You should come, like, all the way at the top. Not all the way, but most of the way. And then you want to come over here. Um, you can skip this part, kind of. But, what just happened? Oh, my hand hit.
you can skip this part <coughs> by jumping from that thing over there and then hitting this thing so then you come like over here but sometimes you do mess up and it will ruin it all so what I normally do um, is just take it slow I just so I go from there and then I jump so I go from there then I jump just like right here or something then I go back up come over here um jump and then just take it slow reach my hand around the corner reach again and then this part um there is a part right here where you can flex to your friends but you might mess up and then they'll laugh at you but you can if you want to and it's like if you can wall like a uh, wall run on slippery right there that little thing where it goes that way you can but I it, it it's no useless kind of um then I usually come down there and then I try to kind of like the wall of death again just easier then I try to come up here I'll come up here again and then I stick my hand around the corner this part pretty easy just stick my hand around the corner and then push and then normal wall run because this part you can probably do and then come here and then stick your hand around the corner and come here and so forth um there are some spots where you might want to like go a little faster so like right there where I just went over you might want to go a little faster just so then it, you're you don't mess up well so then you don't uh, so it's easier I guess you could say okay another attempt of trying to go around At any time, you can go back and start to wall climb, but what is, uh, you can start to go back and wall climb if you need to. If you don't, then it's fine, you don't need to. I'll probably mess up again. Well, um, you didn't see nothing. Uh, I did mess up, but, okay, and then I'm gonna try to show y'all again. Okay, so like and then I'm like right there. Okay, that's how like I think TT pig TTT pig does it. I don't know exactly. Um and then come over here. See the boosted way is you come right here and then you hit off of that. Then go back up. And then Come over here. See, and this is the thing where you can try to flex to your friends. But I I wouldn't suggest it. If You can if you want to, but it doesn't really matter in my opinion. You don't have to do that pinch climb thing. But if you're like all the way down, if you're down more... Then it might be a good thing to suggest, I guess. And then I'm over here. Here. And. Yeah. That's basically it. It is still very difficult. But it is a skill that. that it won't take super long to master. Where you don't have to practice. Like. 24 7 just do it every so often and then you'll start to get better and then you can go farther and you can be faster at it but that's 
seems like it's all in this video. Um, I don't really have much more to say. And I think I just now completed it, right? Because I fell right there, and I climbed back up. Yeah, I think I did. Okay, well, that's all in today's YouTube tutorial, well, Gorilla Tag tutorial. And I hope you have a great day. Um, that's all I gotta say. Bye.